She's gotten really good at it. See? Stella, Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. It is 9.45 a.m. and we have a big tropical storm coming our way. Should be here in a few hours. And I just gave Hydrex a whole bunch of homemade raw food with water mixed in. If he eats that, I'll give him a can of food. Usually he likes to eat a really big meal before any kind of bad weather. And he does have several shelters to go in. He has three shelters to go in to, uh, protect, to protect himself from the weather. All of the heated pet mats have been unplugged, or removed, actually. And so it won't be too hot in there for him. Or it shouldn't be. Good morning, Simba. It is 7.21 a.m. And this is where Simba slept. He slept on this, this little play mat. I can't believe how much they're using it since I brought it upstairs. Good morning, Boo. Boo slept on the cat tower in the bedroom. Then he jumped on the bed this morning and he got some pets. Right, Boo? He says he's gonna, he's gonna lay down and take another nap. Good morning, Stella. How are you? Did you sleep here last night? It is 4.25 p.m. Simba is playing with his little round pom-pom. He found it under some kind of piece of furniture. And he goes crazy over this thing. Right now he's chasing it around the house. Meanwhile, I put the touch feeder out for the cat. And Stella's already getting some crunchies out of it. Here's Boo. He's sitting near them. I put the feeder down near Boo. And he just kind of really didn't go for it. He just kind of just made himself comfortable right there. And of course Stella came over. And this is what happens when Stella comes to get crunchies. Splash comes and eats whatever crunchies Stella gets out of the feeder. She's gotten really good at it. See? She pretty much knows exactly what to do to get the crunchies out. And here's Boo. He doesn't look too happy right now. Did you see how good Stella is at this? Like, she knows exactly where to press it now. I just dispensed some for Boo. It's 5.15 p.m. and look how Stella is sleeping by the back door. She's using the door as a pillow. I don't know how that could be comfortable. Here's Simba. He's laying in the cat tower in Boo's room.
It's 9.09 a.m. I'm just about to leave on an overnight trip. The cats are all set up. Uh, they have dinner in their automatic feeders. They have breakfast tomorrow. They have dinner tomorrow. They have fresh water and the litter was scooped out and the air conditioning is on and everything else is uh, locked up and all of the security cameras are set up and they should be good. Everything should be okay. Okay, Boo, you know what your job is, right? Boo, your job is to look out the windows, make sure no strange people or animals are in the yard. If you see anything in the yard that is out of the ordinary, Boo, anything strange, you let me know, okay? You let me know by your mental telepathy, right, Boo? Okay. Okay, Boo. Okay, you, you be a good boy and you... You relax, and you have a nice relaxing day, and tomorrow you have a nice relaxing day. And tomorrow night I'll be back, okay, Boop? Okay, Boop. Okay, Boop. Be the good, Boo. Be the good, okay? Be the good. Simba, I put a bunch of new toys out for you guys, okay? And I'm going to be away today and tomorrow, and you're in charge of the bugs. You know you're in charge of bugs, right? Okay, so you make sure there's no bugs in the house. Simba just told me that's why he likes to play with those little balls, like those little pom-poms, because he thinks they're bugs, and they're really good practice for hunting bugs, right? Right, Simba? Okay, okay, Simba. Be the good, okay? Be the good. Hello, Stella. Okay, Stella, so we already talked, but I'm just going to remind you, you're in charge while I'm away. I'm away today and tomorrow, and then I'll be back tomorrow night, and you're in charge of making sure everyone gets along, okay? You make sure everyone gets along nicely, okay? Everyone is nice to each other, and everyone minds their manners, and if they don't, you teach them kindly, Stella. You don't bop them, okay? Don't bop people if they're not nice. Just kind of explain to them what they need to be doing, okay? Stella says it's easier for her to bop people because that's what cats understand. Okay, as long as it doesn't turn into a fight. Okay. All right, Stella, see you tomorrow. Splash, you're in charge of the furniture, right? You know you're the furniture guard, right? We scratch on scratching posts and we scratch on cardboard scratchers and we sit on furniture. Right, Splash? You protect the furniture, okay? Okay, that's your job. You protect all the furniture. See you tomorrow, Splash. Splash, you also need to be nice to the other cats, okay? Splash, I want you to be nice to Boo. Got it? Splash? Splash, you're going to be nice to Boo, right? Be nice to Boo. Be nice to Simba. You're always nice to Stella. I know you're a mama's boy. But be nice to Boo and Simba, okay? Okay. Look at what is going on in this flower pot. See all of these styrofoam peanuts? Okay, these were on the bottom of this flower pot. They're on the bottom of the flower pot for drainage. And look, I think it's the squirrel. It's been digging down into the bottom of this flower pot and pulling out all of these packing peanuts. Look, they're all on top. It's crazy. So every day I've noticed a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. And it looks like they're all on top now. So I'm gonna have to clean these out when I get back.
I'm at the beach right now and I've been here for the past few hours and I've been testing out the camera and I'm kind of in the far corner of the beach I'm trying to get away from as many people as possible and it feels so good to be outside in the sun it's my first real beach day of the year and it's incredibly normal here at the beach today like no signs of what the world has been going through for the past several months and it just feels like things are returning back to normal it's an incredibly normal day at the beach today which is great so if you have a beach near you it's so worth uh, going there spending a few hours spending a day you'll feel so much better it's so great to soak in some vitamin D get some Sun if you don't have a beach definitely head out to a park Thank you for watching this Lucky Ferals video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.